continuing on. Where was I? I think I was getting ready to talk about, well, I was talking about the difference between the, what the fluid is supposed to be for, and I can't remember. I think it's just a face cream. I'm going to open it up and see. Yes, it's a type of face cream. I believe it's a tightening face cream. And I stopped by the MAC counter, and she put a couple of paint pots on me, because I didn't, I've never really tried them before. So she gave me a sample of three of them. Groundwork, Constructivist, and Soft Ochre. Soft Ochre is the one that Tatiana Ward uses all the time, you know, be face honey. So I wanted to try it for myself. I mean, I have Maybelline tattoos, but I want to find out what the original thing was about. And then, at the same time, these. Now, I know it would be hard to see because the focus is total crap on this camera as opposed to using my JVC. I'm going to mention my JVC in probably just about every video until I can get it back to where everything was. When my other computer died, it just really did a number on my world. So now I have to use Dino. Dino is a P1. It doesn't, that, that processor is not up to speed with the JVC. These are creme de mess. Creme de la mess, sorry. One of them is, they have a new they have a new lighter formula. It's a, it's, I think they call it soft. The original one, you have to warm up in your fingers before you apply it. There's also a gel version, and that's what this sample is, and this is the original. The gel version looks like that. The original looks like that. I went also to the Bare Minerals little boutique and they gave me a sample of turquoise tea and that's what that looks like. So that's that. My MAC samples came in this. And let's see what else. Cast by Z Gallery. I was in. Goodness. What was I? I think I was in Dillard's or something. And I picked up this little book on Carol Lee, then and now. Supposed to be like, what, 40 years? Yeah. 40 years of little jewelry. Not little jewelry, but nice. A nice jewelry collection. That was a cute little book, so I was like, yeah, why not? Let's see, got some perfume samples as well, got one from Coach, this is just the, I think this is one of the first ones they came out with called Legacy, and then Le Vie et Belle, the new one from Lancome, that features Julia Roberts, you know, as a face. And then I got a sample from, I think this was I went to, was when I went to Dillard's. This is the Miss Dior Le Tattoo. So there's that. And then there are some little tips and everything that I got from the Fair Essential Boutique. There's this survey type of thing that you fill out, hand back in, whereas you pretty much take care of your own friends and family day. I went to Macy's and I was bopping around in there. I have a lot of just like little pamphlets and stuff. I doubt very seriously whether or not y'all really care about all of that. I mean, if you want to see it, let me know, but this is probably like the last thing I'll talk about right here, which is the Privage line that Elizabeth Arden is going to have, because they're actually getting ready to get 
the clinical lash and brow enhancing serum. So I can't wait to get that and try that and see what that's about. But the serum that I have here, I wanted to know what it would do with this. I also want to get some Strivector. And then I'll, you know, eventually I'll get back into exercising and all of that stuff. That came from the drugstore. Samples of olive, the olive oil gloss polisher type thing and the moisturizing lotion I picked up from my beauty supply store. This is a place called Charming Charlie. It has a lot of accessories, purses, shoes, all that good stuff. I actually have a couple of purses I could show you guys, but that's later. And like I said, yeah, the moisturizing soft cream. That's the creme de luna thing there. Box from Sephora, and they have this booklet in there to, you know, brush up on your technique and so on and so forth. These little things here came from Kiehl's. Stuff like that. I picked up another Furby polish from around the corner for three bucks. This one is in Kaleidoscope Eyes. It's got teal, silver, gold, flex. As far as glitter, little round pieces of glitter in there. They were getting rid of the Maybelline, the ones that come in the little beige square tube. That's four ninety nine on there just in case you can't see it. This color is seven forty sparkling sand and that's that. That's how that looks. It's light. The Stopped also by CVS one day before going out to the fashion mall to get to, you know, I wanted to, to pick up some applications and things. Swung by the Rimmel counter and saw the, I love black with gloss even though I don't wear it with everything, but one more thing to add to my collection. This one is called Black. So, yeah. And it was a buy one, get one half off. So, this one is 540 Timeless Allure, which is a nice red color. So, there's that. So, yeah, this little thing is going to be in two parts because I don't. I don't edit with this. It's like why? So, thanks for watching. See you soon.